Hello, and welcome to the Epworth Daily Devotion. Before we begin, let us start with the word of prayer. Dear Lord, thank you for another day. Thank you for this opportunity for us to sit and listen to your word. Please allow us to be able to glean and be able to apply it to our lives. In Jesus' name, amen. Today, we'll be coming from the book of Revelation. Revelation chapter 3, verse 8. And it reads, I know your deeds. See, I have placed before you an open door that no one can shut. I know that you have little strength, yet you have kept my word and have not denied my name. Today, I want us just to briefly talk about he knows. He knows when when I was reading this, it, it, I know we're, um, you know, in the first part of 2024. But it reminded me of Christmas when kids sing the song about Santa Claus, when they say he knows when you are sleeping. <laughs> he knows when you're awake. But right here, we're talking about God. We're not talking about a fictitious Santa Claus that lives in the North Pole and one day out of the year travels around the world in a few hours and delivers gifts. No, 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 no. We're talking about God. And so God knows. And and verse eight in the book of Revelation, chapter three says, I know your deeds. See, I have placed before you an open door that no one can shut. I know that you have little strength. And, and so right here, I just want you to ponder on this. Since he knows, what does he know? And since he knows, what can we do different today? Right. I, 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 he knows what happened yesterday. And I mean, he knows what's going to happen and he holds the future. But what can I do today to make my Lord and Savior smile? What can I do today to live a life according? He knows. But can I do something today to 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 show that the light is inside of me? Because I'm going to tell you what, if he knows and and that door is open, what's on the other side of that door for us? Right. I know me personally, I even after studying and and, and, and doing this podcast, I'm like, Lord, today I, I want to do better. I want when I when I encounter these situations, I want to smile more instead of my face is scrunched up. I want to be able to give. I want. Since he knows the latter part of verse eight says what you have kept my word and have not denied my name. So today, let's make it intentional to give God honor and praise. Let's pray. Lord, we thank you for this day. We thank you for this one verse. Um, Please allow it to touch us in the way that you need it to today so that your light can shine through us in Jesus name. Amen.